Some of the greatest athletes in sports shown as student athletes, setting records and stepping into the spotlight on the biggest of stages. But in Shaquille O'Neal's case, the dynamic center went God mode. Before becoming the first overall pick in the 1992 draft, Shaquille O'Neal was an absolute star at the collegiate level, lighting up the scoreboard and tearing down rebounds at LSU. Even in high school, Shaq was on a completely different level, just based on his natural gifts alone. As the saying goes, you can't teach height, but man, did it come in handy for O'Neal. In his third and final season as an LSU Tiger, Shaq put his name into the NCAA March Madness record books. For those that don't know, March Madness is the NCAA playoffs, where the best school in the nation compete to be champs. All of the cream of the crop faces off in the hopes for glory, with historic schools like Kansas, Duke, Kentucky, and more all facing off for bragging rights and hardware to boot. For LSU, one of the biggest sports schools in the country, the NCAA tourney is what legends are made of, and one of those legends happened to be Shaquille O'Neal. In a matchup against the BYU Cougars in the first round of the tourney, Shaq had an insane triple-double worth remembering. On top of dropping a dominant 26 points against the Cougars, Shaq tore down 13 boards and swatted an inhuman amount of blocks with 11. I mean, the guy was averaging a double-double. Somebody should have seen this coming. He's hard to miss. The big guy did what he did best, and Shaq dominated the Cougars, grabbing rebounds and blocking shots like it was just second nature, like a fish swimming in water or a bird in flight. Shaq moved on instinct. Diesel didn't just get a triple-double. He flat-out embarrassed BYU, looking like a man among boys with the way he outmuscled the Cougars. Shaq forever put his stamp on the history of not just LSU, but the NCAA. Diesel's triple-double with blocks was the first in NCAA history, and to this day, it remains on the record as an anomaly, as one of only two triple-doubles with blocks in NCAA history. It's safe to assume that nobody is going to be sniffing those records, or at the very least, not for a very, very long time. To be that physically imposing and effective as Shaq was is rare, but to be that athletic as well as strong at that young age was wild. That's not even just at the college level. It's at the pros, too. They don't make them like Shaq very often. Not just anyone can do what Diesel did during March Madness or in the NBA, for that matter. Players don't just lace up their sneakers and casually block 10 shots, tack on double digits and rebounds and points, and all of a sudden, Shaquille O'Neal's unreal performance in the NCAA tourney is crazier and may very well be one of the best individual college performances ever. Ever. Take a bow, big fella. I'd say you earned this one. Due to his efforts, Shaq and LSU won the game 94 to 83. But the celebration over Shaq's incredible achievement was short lived. LSU went on to lose in the second round to the Indiana Hoosiers. But while their tourney that year didn't have a happy ending, Shaq left a huge mark on the world of college sports. He's fourth in all-time leading scoring for his alma mater, as well as second in all-time rebounds in school history. He's since been inducted into the LSU Hall of Fame, and his impact at LSU stands to this day. I mean that literally, because LSU has a 900-pound bronze statue made of him, located outside of LSU's basketball practice facility. Turns out, legends are made of bronze too. Is Shaq's March Madness performance the greatest of all time? Let us know in the comments below, or if you've got a better one. And be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Don't miss any of our fresh content.